Gail Gregoire usually gives the rides. <laughs> this time, she rode passenger. That'd be awesome. She hasn't stepped outside a hospital or doctor's room in six months. How are you? Oh, oh nice my to see goodness, you. it's good to see you. What? But Gail couldn't miss her Lakeview Lakers, what? playing down the street from her rehab home in Minneota. It is wonderful to be back at the football field. Gail drove the varsity team's bus to road games for almost a decade. Last February, everything changed after she went to the hospital for a routine operation. We were supposed to go home the next day. Steve Gregoire then learned his wife's surgery had been followed by a stroke. And they did a CAT scan on her brain and found a brain tumor. A lot of tough stuff. It left the Lakers without their bus driver. When she had her uh, episode uh, last year, it was devastating to our whole community. She's like everybody's mom in a way. Gail is our everything. The coaches and players hadn't seen her all year. That's the bus. It was the perfect time for a reunion. Thank you. Come here. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we love you, Gail. Hey, we know you'd be driving the bus tonight, right? Yes, You would have drove would. us over. We love you. Right? It's a good moment. Thank you, Gail. You bet. Hey, kiddo. Hey. Wow. Look at you guys. Gail now owns a jersey signed by every player. I love it. Yeah. She faces uncertainty ahead. Got a little ways to go. So. But at least Gail, for one night, is with her boys. It's great. It's really fun. These boys mean a lot to me. Danny Spiewak, Carol 11 News, Minneota.